throughout our lives we will meet many characters, but one character in particular will stand out amongst the rest, the courageous type who seems to fear nothing. It appears these people always land on their feet in life and are true embodiments of the saying, fortune favours the bold. Not to mention they stand out in a world where courage seems to be in such short supply with most people choosing to snuggle under their covers than to reenact the trials of Hercules. So, what's their secret? And how can we become more courageous? Firstly, to become more courageous, we must understand courage need not always involve unleashing one sword and slaying the dragon, figuratively speaking. Courage could involve everyday acts such as starting a conversation in an elevator, choosing to let the passerby know they've just dropped something, or stopping your obsessive thinking so you can begin to think about what really matters. Because sometimes we think we're not courageous simply because we don't look low enough. And for the times where we are called upon to slay the dragon, step on stage, dance in front of strangers, or sell everything and travel the world, we can recite the mantras... It will either be a good time or a good story, and things are much scarier before they occur. Because if there's one thing the courageous have in common, it's the belief that their act of courage will be worth it, regardless of whether they succeed or fail. So, with this in mind, when we approach the stranger, give a speech at a wedding, or simply stand up for ourselves against a bully, every act of courage will become a win-win situation. Because we'll either enjoy ourselves while it's happening, or we'll have a worthy story to tell at our next social gathering. And, when you take the leap in the dark, you'll realise the thing you were worried about isn't so scary after all, and you'll find you are a lot more capable than you once thought. So, to be courageous, understand, your leap in the dark will either be a good time or a good story.